Hello, this is Borna from Borna.tv, and today I want to talk about Windows. Windows 8, Windows 8.1. A big issue that prevents people from upgrading to Windows 8.1 from whatever they're coming from is that they don't like the tiled interface. Tons and tons of people complain that it's built for a touchscreen and it's way too much for what they need. And it all boils down to missing the start menu. This is kind of funny because I remember when the start menu was ridiculed <laughs> when it came out, when it first came out, a lot of people were like, oh, that's so dumb. And now people are really attached to it. So today I want to talk about a solution that I use on my Windows 8.1 that someone on my Patreon pointed out. This comes from user Nate and he asked, Borna, I noticed in one of your videos you were using Pocky. Do you still use it? Perhaps you can make a video about why you like slash love it. And my response is, hmm, Okay. So what is Pocky? Pocky is a start menu replacement. It's essentially a program designed to perform a lot of the features and functions that you're used to from your Windows start menu and Windows 7 and above or below. That's how you think of it. Windows XP days, Windows 97, 95, 94, 93. Anyway, this is what it looks like. It is a menu that pops up like this. And, uh, it's very familiar. I mean, it's got a lot of the elements that you're used to seeing in a ton of your uh, start menu programs out there. One of my favorite features that I like about it and why I do love it is that it supports search. So if I wanted to play Marvel Heroes, uh, the test client, I just type Marvel. And it searches my machine for apps. It searches files. It also does some web searches as well. And I could click this and optionally add it to my favorites, which is the menu you saw before on my launch page. And I've got several apps that I use quite a bit on here that I can just simply bring up and I can launch them um, simply by hitting the start menu button on my keyboard. And that's what I do a lot of times when I'm live streaming. People are like, what, what was that? What was that? Well, that was Pocky. Uh, <laughs> and this is a great great program <clears throat> excuse me and it is free free to download and I'll put the link in the show description so you can check it out some of the options that are here if you go to the settings you'll see that you can change the theme from light to dark uh, you can show certain things in the sidebar here uh, such as computer connections control panel devices and printer so a lot of the common things you usually see on the Windows start menu uh, or you can say show recently used apps you can check that and it shows them down here um, also there are some advanced settings like showing the icon I like to use the Windows icon so it kind of fits in um, and uh, open the start menu when I press the Windows key you can turn it off and on so it's a lot of little options on where you can position it and such but if you want to go back to the Windows menu at any time there's a button down here you just hit that and boom you go down to the Windows menu Windows start menu. Now they also have some little bells and whistles for their PC app store. And if you click this, it launches this store interface. It allows you to download these pre-configured apps. And what they are are just simply containers for a lot of popular web applications such as VLC, Skype, iTunes, Facebook, and some games as well that fit inside of the browser like Farmville, Pirate Storm, etc. If you use Pandora or SoundCloud, Spotify, they have apps for these as well. Uh, Outlook, uh, Gmail for Pocky, Yahoo Mail is also on here. So you can see there's a lot of different pre-configured apps and lots of uh, things that you can use utilities in the Pocky menu. So this is one from one.tv. I just really want to quickly show that uh, Pocky is a good replacement for Windows 8, Windows 8.1. And if the start menu is the only thing, the only thing that's keeping you from, from using Windows 8, then maybe you should consider using Pocky as a replacement because I think it's a good fill in for, uh, you know, just for that feel of the Windows start menu. And again, you don't have to boot to the tile interface. You don't have to see the tiled interface in Windows 8 at all. You can go right to your desktop and most times people can't tell the difference between Windows 8 and Windows 7 until you go to that tiled interface. So uh, just wanted to give you guys another option and your utility tool belt for Windows stuff. All right guys, take care, have a great day. <laughs>